Recently appointed as Zimbabwe under-17 national team coach, Moses Chunga has hit the ground running and will leave no stone unturned in identifying raw talent across the country. Chunga attended the Conference of Heads of Independent Schools in Zimbabwe Cheese Tournament in Matebelele and South as Falcon High School, where private schools battled it out in a 14-team tournament eventually won by defending champions at Peterhouse. These youngsters, they have uh, dreams and uh, you will find uh, that um, uh, most of uh, the A schools are not g g given uh, the necessary exposure. We just hear that uh, now we have got a Zimbabwe playing in, in uh, Europe, uh, but uh, you don't know where he, he first started playing football. And uh, it is my hope that uh, is the national team coach I will give them my uh, exposure because uh, they too need uh, to be noticed. Chunga seems impressed with what he saw and is in the process of creating a working relationship with private schools. There is uh, a lot of uh, talent, uh, but what I've seen uh, which is lacking is the uh, intensity side. And uh, uh, I am creating uh, synergies uh, with the A schools and uh, we will try to rectify that and uh, I am very happy that uh, we are getting all the necessary support. Because Chunga is working with youngsters, he understands that the results take time in coming. All the same, he believes he will be up to the task and with time his efforts will yield the desired results. I know it's a challenge but it's not a challenge to me because I know that uh, development uh, takes a long time. and. Uh, this one is just at uh, the beginning. It is a crash program, but uh, we'll, we'll go through it. Chunga's presence at the cheese tournament was welcomed as a motivation for the boys who would be keen to impress and hopefully catch the eye of the national soccer team coach. I certainly feel that um, it would be a big motivating factor. I know that Falcon boys uh, always hope that they are going to be selected to represent Zimbabwe, that uh, representing the country is considered an honor as as indeed it should be and so the possibility um, of doing that in soccer um, I'm, I'm quite sure that uh, the guys are, are wanting to impress. Begin Pilonioni, a member of the Zimbabwe Football Association as Technical and Development Committee is the head selector of the cheese tournament and coordinated the selection of 30 outstanding players who will be trimmed to 20 for a trip to either Germany or South Africa in August. Because of the immense potential in talent within the boys at private schools, Nyoni had invited Chunga to the tournament and indeed the country is likely to benefit from the coach's presence at the cheese tournament. When I was told about this tournament, I I decided to talk to Bambo, uh, to Moses Chunga, to say, Moses Chunga, there is an under-20 tournament, but I know there are some few boys who are under-17 who might be at this tournament. And he welcomed the idea, and he's part of us, and I'm so grateful for him with his passion and everything, and the effort he put to find him here. And so far, he has seen one or two players whom we feel, if we put them in the right system, and the co coordinate properly with other players, some of them might even end up turning professional. Moses continues with his talent search at Bulawes Railton grounds and proceeds to Gweru on Monday, June the 26th. Given Chunga's history with junior players, there is so much expectation to what Chunga will unearth and the nation just can't wait to see the group of boys that will be assembled by Bambo. Television Sport Media, Bulawayo.